Major news from Coinbase today, just 10 minutes ago, they have announced L2 for Ethereum coming from Coinbase, incubated inside with some great things also. So in this video, I'm going to cover everything I could find in 10 minutes uh, from, the, from the launch. So actually, this is going to be pretty hectic, but it's really, really cool. So first of all, uh, this new L2 is called Base. Uh, they have a Twitter account built on Base where you can uh, follow them. Uh, they're getting the, the followers quickly and do a bunch of stuff. So basically, uh, Base is an Ethereum L2 that offers secure, low-cost, developer-friendly way for anyone, anywhere to build decentralized apps. What they're doing is actually they want to onboard as many people as possible. Uh, I have read already that they have used Optimism stack. Uh, so Optimism is another layer two for Ethereum and they have collaborated with them to uh, have build, uh, be, be base being built. That's pretty cool. They have also the video that uh, I can play for you, uh, basically talking about uh, the future, which is on-chain, decentralized. Generally speaking, uh, this move was expected to certain reason. Of course, uh, they, don't, they can't really do a token uh, because they already are a public company, you know, the ticket coin they're on a New York Stock Exchange so they really can't airdrop a token this is the second best thing they can do uh, base itself won't have a native token the native token itself will be if all the gas will be paid in if uh, so uh, it's similar to some of the other uh, uh, layer two but this is also cool this is like a major news also for Ethereum uh, and the whole ecosystem of DeFi. as you can see for example Aave uh, Sushi Swap and a bunch of other tools are coming uh, the whole list is on the uh, on a website so this is major news for uh, for the ethereum ecosystem uh, i would expect there will be some kind of incentives for playing around with uh, this new blockchain in the very beginning because they will want to have new users also also this is great from the perspective of coinbase itself because uh, the company is you know holding different assets in custody for the users and having them on chain to a certain extent uh, is really great and especially on chain that is uh, entirely owned by the company so it really makes sense uh, this is uh, what they already announced so as i've mentioned base is not a token we do not plan to issue a new network token for base and we'll use if as the native gas token you can learn more about built on base i will cover that uh, but basically they want to be super scalable here so uh, everything inside the base is in the blog post i will also cover that in a moment but the cool thing here is that there is something for for all the users uh, namely there's a free nft on zora that you can mint uh, one per address one per wallet freely mintable so of course wait for the gas to be lower because right now all the people are hyped and want to uh, mint that um, this is unlimited but there's only three days to mint uh, the the commemorative nft will that have any value we don't know but maybe uh, there will be some incentive to have that nft to do some other stuff on chain we don't know. Uh, if you want to have it, definitely do that. Uh, the, as I've mentioned, Mint is free uh, and you can mint it on Zora. This is how it looks after you connect the wallet. Uh, 2,500 uh, uh, minted already NFTs and it changes quickly. As you can see, people are minting uh, three days, 14 hours from now. So you have plenty of time to mint it. Um, this is the, the mid base NFT uh, for, for really commemorative NFT for the launch of base. So going to the blog and the website, the website for uh, base is base.org. Um, and this is how it looks like. Uh, really simple one basically allowing you to start bridging and using different assets on base uh, they want to make the everything scalable so of course uh, this the gas should be super cheap for for the usage uh, empowered by coinbase so i think this is the biggest plus here is that you will get the connection to all, all the coinbase products users assets and so on and this is really really huge because as they as they mentioned they have 110 million verified users 80 billion dollars on the assets on the platform which is really huge uh, so base is powered by optimist op stack making it one of the most secure scalable evm uh, so Ethereum virtual machine L2s out there. The OP stack is an open source public good that will serve as the foundation for a super chain of L2s that share interoperability, sequencing and governance. Base is incubated within Coinbase and plans to progressively decentralize in the years ahead. We believe that decentralization is critical to creating an open global crypto economy 
that is accessible to everyone. This is something that Brian Armstrong, CEO of Coinbase, is really mentioning a lot. Uh, and I really like his stance against the regulators or like he wants to really dialogue with them. He's not scared uh, talking with them and he wants to present the crypto industry in the best way possible, which is really great stuff. And launching base really makes sense from that perspective. So commitment to uh, do everything on chain. As you can see here, there are a lot of partners already for uh, for base, which is really great. Coming with uh, DeFi, NFTs, games, and so on. So the standard things. Uh, I would expect that some of those applications will be incentivized uh, by, you know, for example, you could yield farm probably in the beginning uh, much more on those apps on base rather than on the standard Ethereum and so on. So. This is really exciting. So uh, this is the this is the website. Uh, also, you can go to the docs directly and start reading about the base uh, directly from the website. I will of course provide all the links down below. So if you need that, uh, it's all there uh, with the link to the Mint, with the link to the Twitter, with the link to the website. So don't worry about that. Just scroll down to get the to get the link to get the link. So finally, uh, there is a blog post as I've mentioned on Coinbase itself. Uh, summarizing everything that they've been building. Uh, so low cost, secure, developer friendly way to build decentralized apps on chain connected with Coinbase. So giving you access to uh, their crypto products and their users, which is really, really great. Uh, so uh, why we're building base to bring in billions of users to the crypto economy, dApps need to be easier, cheaper and safer to interact with. This is something uh, you have to agree with. For this to happen, we need to make it even easier for developers to build these dApps. As we're building base, we're explicitly adhering to a few core principles. A bridge, not an island, so easy to connect with other ecosystems uh, for not only Ethereum, but also things like Solana, great stuff. Uh, and also Coinbase products, also great open source. So everything will be open source, you'll be able to read everything. Also the fact that they building on optimism stack tells us a lot uh, that is open source, decentralized. Uh, finally, they don't want to be based around just one company owning everything. They want to have developers from outside of Coinbase to help, uh, which is really great. And finally for everyone, because they want to have the scale uh, for everyone to use it. Base ecosystem fund. So they will be announcing the base ecosystem fund where they invest in early stage projects building on base that meet our investment criteria. So for those interested, you can already fill the form and uh, be in touch with base. So probably in the very beginning, uh, there will be many incentives for developers to build on the platform because developers are crucial for any uh, new blockchain out there. Uh, and that's really it. Uh, finally, there's of course a thread uh, from built on base. So built on base is a Twitter account. I will provide the link if you want to follow the developments. Uh, this is the uh, this is the, also the introduction to, to BASE, hello world, uh, explaining what is BASE, that it's not a token, uh, but it's a little bit more detailed that, that, than what appears on Coinbase website uh, with so, uh, some more details about uh, the bridge that wants to connect both uh, Bitcoin and Solana on top of Ethereum. So that's really great stuff. Uh, decentralization, so they cover basically everything that is said in a blog post and they want to be they want to have a twitter spaces so that's coming in a couple of hours uh, fr from now so if you want to join that uh, th then uh, of course join the twitter space to listen to everything they have to say this probably will be amazing uh, and finally mint again nft uh, for free uh, and visit the, uh, visit the website. So that's it for, for base. Uh, really excited about that because again, this, this will probably provide more users coming on chain from Coinbase, uh, should be easy to use, uh, should have a lot of incentives in the beginning. So I will cover base on my channel. So don't forget to subscribe if you want to be uh, on date with everything happening with base or other blockchains, other protocols, DeFi, NFT collections, and much more. So subscribe and see you in the next video.